Hello ladies and gentlemen, my name is Andrew Wesker Delta. Welcome back to another indie horror game. This one is called Mystery, Curiosity, and Seek the Truth. Now this game takes place in an abandoned mental hospital. It's been abandoned for about 30 years now. This game's about a year old, but it was originally released in Arabic. They recently just added English subtitles so people who, you know, speak and read in English can now play. I'm very excited for it. It actually does look very, very creepy. Uh, I guess other than that, let's hop right into it. Keep in mind, it's English subtitles, not English uh, voiceovers, so you do need to read the actual subtitles if you want to keep up with the story. WASD is to move player, shift is to sprint, spacebar is jump, uh, click is to shoot or throw. Cool, so you can shoot. That's always good. Uh, and right click is to pick, open doors, or aim. And then the number zero is to hide an item, like notes. Before the game begins, please again to use hi uh, please use headphones. Raise the sound and shut off the it's lights. Me. عاد طبعا راح ادخل في صلب الموضوع ما ادري ان كنت سمعته في القصه ولا لا لكن اللي سمعته من الناس اللي حولي يقولون ان في مكان معزول وبعيد عن المدينه ويقولون ان في مستشفى مهجور صار له اكثر من 30 سنه مثل مستشفى شهار للامراض العقليه قالوا لي الشباب اللي ما اقرب منه سالتهم ليش وش في بالضبط؟ قالوا لي لا تدخل ابد. سمعنا انه في اشياء غريبة تحصل هناك. أكثر من شخص دخل وما قدر يطلع. من بعد ما سمعت الكلام حسيت اني قد سمعته من قبل. مرت الأيام وجلست أفكر في الموضوع. جاني فضول إني أروح لهذا المكان. ما أدري وش السبب. قررت في الأخير إني أروح للمستشفى الصحي. وصلت للمستشفى. أخيراً. لكن أول ما دخلت سمعت صوت غريب وأحس الهواء ثقيل. ما قدرت أتنفس. وفجأة جاني صداع وأغمى علي. بعد كم ساعة قمت ولقيت نفسي في داخل المستشفى. وهنا تبدأ القصة والاستكشاف الحقيقي. هم. <تصفيق> Well, the first mistake you made was entering an abandoned hospital. Because I wouldn't do it. Okay, so this door doesn't open. Just thought I'd try. Let's head in this direction, then. Alright, let's turn up the volume. Let's get real loud up in here. What are you doing here? Oh, you know. Just visiting. Oh! Oh my god, already? Are you serious? Oh, this isn't... Where's the Where's the actual computer? They stole everything but the keyboard? Why would you do this? Oh, well, I don't read Arabic, so that's a shame. Um, yes, moving on. This door is locked. Ew. Rashes and infections and like gross shit. Ugh, no, thank you. <laughs> oh my god, is it gonna fucking do this all time? <laughs> Damn it, man. This place is very scary. Oh, you poor person. I'll have you know I have a very good job and I make a lot of money. I am not poor. <laughs> Joke's on you, dead guy. Okay, maybe I don't make a lot of money. Warning, always check your pants before you drink your own piss. That's what this sign says. That is, I swear, that is what it says. Why is there so many doors? I don't know where to go. <laughs> November 18th, 1982. A new patient came today and I checked on his situations. <laughs> you can punch! I will just hold this note and punch all the monsters! The new patient seems to be eccentric. It's like I'm starting to feel regretting being a nurse. So, zero is to put it away, right? Cool. Coolio, coolio. Let's see what's in here. A bathtub. Alright. Oh, cool! 
Why is this mannequin model in every freaking indie horror game? Oh, that door's open now. Okay. It's a trap! So, what? She cut her wrist in her throat or something? That's, un that's, that's very, very unfortunate. Alright, so this door was locked, right? Or was this not locked? Not anymore. Oh my god, I hate that. Yes? There was someone knocking at the door. Is it you? No, it wouldn't be me. It would not be me. It would be definitely someone else. Oh no. Oh, Nelly. I can't even open doors. Oh, yes I can. Is that a key? You got the key! Once again, check your pants before you piss. Or something. <laughs> something like that, I don't know. Oh! oh. oh. Someone just got decapitated, I guess. Oh my god, this is gonna get me every time. Oh, hey. Hey, this model's from Slender. It's one from one of the Slender games. I remember that. I think it was Slender Elementary, actually. Much to my vast Slender knowledge. Seriously, though, I think I'm right on that one. Feel free to, feel free to cite me on that. I think that that player model is from Slender Elementary. Boom! Just drop the knowledge bomb, mind your bitches. I'm sorry, I love you. You're not a bitch. You are not of the female dog. Alright, so let's see where this key is used because I have no idea. The jumping seems useless because there's like only one floor. And I haven't seen a place where you would need to jump. Cool. Cool. Another note. This one says, November 22nd, 1982. Can you stop banging while I read? The new patient became so much more exotic. He is not talking nor answering to our questions. The doctor tells me that he is dangerous and committed a horrible crime. Yeah, like banging on stuff while people are trying to read. That is a punishable offense. Something's going to flash on the screen in three, two, one. Ah, I was wrong. It just seemed like it just seemed like that's that was what was gonna happen. Okay, well we did get a key, so let's go see if any of these doors that were previously locked are maybe unlocked now. What was this again? This was unlocked, right? Yeah. Okay. Just making sure. Let's head back in this direction. Try all these doors again. Yeah. Right. Those were the infections. So this door over here was locked. Let's see if it's open now. Nope, it is still locked. All right, awesome. So now we need to figure out exactly where the hell this key is supposed to go. Because I don't have an idea at this point. Now I am confused. This is a dead end, right? Yes, okay. So if this is a dead end and I came from that way, we must maybe go this direction again? I don't know. That was, yeah, right. That was where the mannequin was. And that was where we got a note. Maybe I missed, maybe I missed a door? Because this one's locked, right? Yes, this one's locked. And then this one, I was just in here. Unless I missed something in one of these lockers. Oh, there's a note here. Nope, that's not a note. That is just a static texture. That's just your average texture. No, really, there's no keys in here. Okay, so... Hello? Can someone tell me where to go? Maybe? You? Oh, there's someone knocking... Oh, no, I read that already. I thought it said something else. You tricky little sign. You little bastard. 
Or maybe one of these doors opened since I... Yeah, I think this opened. I don't think I remember going down here. Nope. This is definitely new. Okay, we're good. Things randomly open. And we got a key. Now we can go back and try all the doors again. Okay. Now that we got a key... We can try this door. I don't... I have a bad feeling about this. Well, let's go. I just have some kind of feeling. And why is there a health bar? Nothing's attacked me yet. That is concerning to me. It's like, why would they tell you that there's a health bar if nothing attacks you? So something's going to attack me soon. Real soon. Yes. Okay. We use a key on that door. Right. We are now loading up another part of the game. Probably a much ha harder part and possibly scarier. Hopefully less jump scares and more actual scares, but you know, to each his own, to each his own. A new patient came today, it's just a situation, okay, we've seen this one already. Moving on. That's shut, completely. More spray paint, yes, what does that say? Oh, his actions are really bad. Wow, that's a good doctor. The guy's crazy. Let's kill him. Screw medicine and treatments. Let's just kill the guy. Where are you looking at? Oh, you mean what are you looking at? I'm looking at you, stupid spray painting. Oh, okay. I guess that was a bad answer. That was a bad answer, apparently. I pissed someone off. Pissed someone off. All right, I am out of here. <laughs> oh, that's creepy as hell. You're going so fast. Slow down, man. That's what that sign says. All right. So this room offers me nothing but a, a jump scare. That didn't actually scare me. So, yeah. <laughs> Whoa! Why must you scream? Right in my ears. Hey, a key. I'm guessing I'm not supposed to go this way. I'm probably supposed to go back to one of those locked doors. But, you know, I do what I want to do. I do what I want. Yeah, never mind. I should have just went back, like I said. Alright. So this is a dead end. Note to self. Note to shelf. That was not good. Alright, so this is where we got it, I think. Yep, okay. So this one was locked, I think? Yes, okay, but the key does not open that one. And then I think I went in this one. Yes. And I believe I went in this one. Oh, no, I haven't been in this one. There's another key! Yes? Hello? Is it Mr. Frankensberg? Hey, there's no one there. Don't you troll me. And then we've been in this one. Okay. Alright, so... Which doors were locked again? This one right here is locked, I think. Nope, this is the office, right? So this one here is locked. Right! زين 
بقدر اقول لك انك جيت في الوقت المناسب <تصفيق> لكن اسمع اقول لك عليه ونفذه بالحرف الواحد اي والله تتعلم شلون شلون وابشر اللي تبي اه تطمن تتخلص منه وللابد <تصفيق> والله انك تعجبني تعجبني <laughs> what? That was the most sketchiest conversation between two doctors I have ever seen. Whoa. November 25th, 1982. Today a new doctor will come from another hospital. They told me that he got a highly experienced and very skilled. I hope he will be nice too. Alright, that is definitely the most sketchy... Entering the right access code should open this door. Enter the four digit code. I don't have the four digit code. Is it. Leet? It's not Leet. Okay. Um, we need to find the four digit code. Do you have it in your carcass? Probably not. Alright. So the one doctor's like, man, I hate this guy. He's crazy, even though we work in a mental hospital and we're supposed to deal with crazy people. I know, man. He's so crazy. I just want to kill him. But the police will know. <laughs> kill him anyways, man. We'll, we'll kill him. We'll do it. Let's do it. Let's kill this guy. All right. Sure. <laughs> we're doctors. We don't help people. We just kill them. Duh. <laughs> oh, doctors. If I ever go crazy, I will not go to a mental hospital. I'm pretty sure I am crazy, actually, at this point in time. I am talking to myself in a microphone, playing horror games. So, hmm. Alright, let's find this four-digit code. Four-digit code. No, I don't remember seeing any four-digit codes on any of the doors or anything like that. And I'm pretty sure all the notes we read, none of them had any num numerical little notes or values on them at all. Oh, so here's all the here's all the notes. Maybe nineteen eighty two? That's the only thing I could think of. Code invalid right off the bat. Well, you know what we could do? Trial and error. So six is the first number, and then six. Six. Six, six. Nope. Six, four. Six, five? Six, six. Six, one. Ha! Six, one, two, six, one, three. Ha <laughs> six one four Ha six one eight two six one eight three six one eight four Hey Hey! We did it! Smart Bob Infante. Swing. We did it! We did it! We did it! Hooray, Mama Zitos! We did it! Dun, 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 dun. I don't know if I was supposed to do that or if I was actually supposed to look for a code, but hey, problem solving for the win! When in doubt, trial and error it out. That doesn't make sense. Does this door open now? It still doesn't open. What the hell? I don't know any other locked doors. What door could that have unlocked? I'm confused. Could that have maybe like unlocked the laptop and then I need to like open? The I don't know. What is going on? That's the chair. Let's try this. I don't get it. And why are they using an IBM? They make horrible laptops. This isn't 1980. Actually, technically, this would have been like 1980 when they would have bought these laptops, I guess. Is 
Is that the door over there that just opened? That one all the way down there? Because none of the, Yeah, I think that's it. Let's see what happens. Oh, cool! What the hell are these things? December 11th... No, December 1st, 1982. The looks of the patient... The looks of the patient at me gets more weirdly and more evil looking. And not hiding... Also, that the new doctor is eccentric. I have oh my fucking shit! Oh, oh, no. oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Did I just die? It won't let me sprint! Oh my god! Where am I supposed to go? Why does it keep stopping me? Come on, man! Oh my god! I am standing on this desk and I am putting my foot down! I'm guessing he can't come in here and I'm guessing it won't end until I get away from him. So I will lead him in here. Come on, really? Oh, come on. Really, this guy can't even go through doors. Ow, but he can stab me. He can stab me. That works. Now I'm just trapped in here forever. Ah. Oh, come on. Through the door. Oh, my God. He keeps... You glitch hacksaw. During gameplay, don't forget to save. Oh, yeah. So you can go back to the same area. Oh, thank you. You give me the note after I'm dead. You tell me after I'm dead. You bastard. Alright guys, I guess this is a perfect time to go ahead and end this video. If you want to see a part 2 of this game, let me know in the comment section below. Leave a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. God, that actually scared the shit out of me when I was reading that note. If you want to see uh, a part 2, let me know. Thank you guys so much for watching. Subscribe if you want to see more. Leave a like if you enjoyed it. Thank you guys so much. I love your faces. Have a good day. Bye-bye.